Uh, I'll do a slideshow here. So this guy in the background is Baxter. He's the new brat of the flock. Um, you can get him five days a week in full color at goalscomic.com. Goalscomic.com. Write that down. And I've also got little collections that I put out every now and again that do a catalog the last few months of comics. So, little, yeah, a little, little collection there of uh, stories and zaniness that the flock may bring about. And this is about 10 pages. Yep. Uh, Those are usually free at local comic book shops. So Very high quality. Keep your eyes I mean, this open. is definitely a collector's item if uh, somebody is into that kind of stuff. And then this is uh, the secondary comic that I do called Minus Tide. And uh, it's pretty, pretty zany. And these are one shots. Yeah, all one shots. Plundering the jolly instead of Jolly Roger. He's got positive plundering. He's a nice, <laughs> nice pirate. He's a smiling one. <laughs> <laughs> This one's got a lot of little gags in it. This is, uh, you got Dead Man's Chest Rub. You got Yo Ho 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 Candy Canes. You got Need a Piece of Eight, Take a Piece of Eight. <laughs> All at a uh, Pirate's Mini Mart there. Yeah. Minus Tide is a little dark. He's definitely a little darker <laughs> than, uh, not sleeping. than uh, Gull's comic. Some battered fish jokes. Yeah. But uh, yeah, Minus Tide, uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. Now where is this one showing up? This one uh, used to be in a publication along the Oregon coast. And uh, they've ceased running it because the newspaper business is dying out. And uh, that's a, a bummer for a lot of artists. But the great thing about New Avenues is that you get this awesome interview process that you guys have put together. There's the web. Thank you. Yeah, there's all sorts of new avenues, and I feel there's a, a passion for it, and you want to get art out there. It'll survive. It doesn't matter what the medium is. You know, we'll create the new medium. You know, the artist can dictate what and how things get out there. It's really true. You just have to open your mind up to the fact that there's all kinds of new opportunities and not be like, oh, that's not art, you know, or no, 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 that's selling out, or no, 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 no. We're all just creating what we can create the best we can, and we're getting it out there the best we know how. We're trying know? to have fun. It's really, like, have fun and create art. Yep. Survive. Life, life, is, <laughs> life is short. You got to do it for yourself first. And uh, so you know, he's I do, got, this, do this comic for myself. Yeah. He's developed this book. This is seven years. Seven years, yeah. Wow. It's uh, a complete... It's really high quality. I'm going to be getting a couple of these. Uh, one for myself, one for a gift. Really high quality. Um, tell them where you can get that. You can get this book. If you want to get it and see it physically, you can get it at uh, Bridge City Comics here in Portland, Oregon. That's on Mississippi. You can get it at Cosmic Monkey Comics on Sandy. And you can also go to goalscomic.com and buy it there. Um, runs about 20 bucks. Prices will fluctuate from different vendors, but 20 bones, and that gets you uh, over 1,200 comics. So this is the the, that, black, the black and white years. That's it's, amazing. It's really nice. Yeah, and, and this is really a high quality comic. I mean, he's this he's is the first book gonna, that you've put out. Um, yeah, this is really the big first uh, tome of it. Uh, this is actually a collection of uh, five books that I've done. Wow. And okay. I figure, let's just take all of the black and white ones and just amass it together, because now the comic is in full color, and uh, the black and whites just needed to live together as one. Yeah. And it's like a, it's a, it's a cool thing to see the, the art change. There's comics in the early parts of this book that I, I wouldn't ever do like that again. <laughs> I don't draw like that anymore. Right. And uh, it's, it's a nice growth process. Yeah, so, yeah. You know, Oh wow! They get a lot more complicated. Yeah, it gets a lot more in depth. Uh, the contrast gets much heavier in the end. Uh, it's, it's gotten better. I've gotten better, and that's what I think art's about. It's just you know, this, just keep doing your craft. Just keep he's, doing. He's it. got a nine to five, and he's doing this on the side. What do you, yeah. this what is do you his do passion. in your day job? Uh, I am a I'm a production designer, so I do a lot of oversized printing. 
I do a lot of file preparation, a lot of design, so it's it's a lot, and it's definitely it keeps me very very busy. So the the comic stuff is you know up at 5 a.m. coffee, let's get this going, do a comic strip before work, come wow. home, and you know anytime I can, I'm I'm done storyboarding. You know I got my little oh, really? yeah yeah. We yeah. asked him to bring some original artwork, and he's this like, this is it. This yeah. is all you're gonna get. Uh, all the real artwork that I have. This is it. I don't have any anything that's real besides this sketchbook. Because everything else is on uh, it's online. It's all on the computer. I mean this is just this book right here is is gold. I mean this is just artistic beauty as far as I'm concerned. It's really wonderful. Thanks. I love all the work you've done here. Thank you. Yeah, it's it's a lot of fun just to jot down what I need to do and uh, yeah, this is the only the only carbon footprint that I leave is in these books. Well, you put that in your will. <laughs> <laughs> Sadly, I recycle them after I'm done. No, no, what? Do that. I do. Dude, I do. What the wow. fuck? Send it's them just, to me. It's I'll just, sell them. It's just how I do. It's just my my mental release. <laughs> oh, that hurts. Everybody needs it, I guess. But I'm starting to clean it. Yeah, but with reactions like that, I'm starting to rethink my <laughs> my process. I that still hurts. have. No, I still really have, hurts. I'll never get rid of the original sketches. You know, those if, are uh, there forever. If Charles Schultz, yeah, you know, I mean, his family's got all of his old, you know, and that shit's worth a lot. It is. Of money. It Doctor is. Doctor Seuss, you know. But and I and the, I think and that's a different. You don't think you're gonna get that big, do you? Uh. Ooh, Charles, that's that's some that's some shoes to fill. Yeah, it that's is a lot of uh, it's life a different, insurance. It's a different world too now. Yeah, whereas you know, it's not like it's the physical the physicality of it isn't what it used to be. You know, I don't I gave up. You know, the, some of these in this book were pen and ink, and then I do them all pen and ink and then scan them in. But it's not like that anymore. I just use a, a Wacom tablet and it's all digital, and it's it's nice because I mean, if you've got the technology to work in your favor. You could still capture that spirit of art, and you know, purists will say, "Oh, he's not doing pen and ink, or he's not doing it the traditional way." And I say hogwash to that. If you get what you want, uh, you know, if you see it in your mind and you get it out, who cares how you got yeah, there? There's a million ways to get to that final, final product. So awesome. So the con, the uh, website is goalscomic.com. Goalscomic.com. You can find Minus Tide there as well. What's uh, what's your next step? Do you have a, a new book or a new show coming up? Right now, I just got done doing the, the summer shows, uh -huh. so I did. I'm in the middle of wrapping up a video cataloging that. So oh wow, I got no no shows on the horizon, which is nice. <laughs> um, but the the new goals book will probably be out um, after next year. So I got a little, I got a little breather here because I got to get all the color comics together, and then make another book. So it's got a little ways to go. So this is a uh, as far as producing actual physical pieces, it'll be a little bit light in 2015, but... Well, it gives uh, you a little time to mark, yeah, we market look forward to that. Yeah, no. really. Thank you. Yeah, I do too. I really do. I love having things cataloged in, in, in a book. It just seems so complete in a book. Yeah, it's so beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Um, I don't really have anything else. You got any final words, brother? Enjoy your Sunday. Yeah. Thanks Thank for watching. Thank you for tuning in. We love you. Uh, find us on Facebook. Share us. Uh, follow my YouTube. Jacob I Wolf. Think that's it. W O L F F. Two F's, no E. <laughs> love guys. you. Bye.